and welcome to the system uh, the video is about NeoFetch I wanted to have a logo again so a picture of um, Arco Linux in NeoFetch and I used the time to also check out if there are new configurations on uh, the NeoFetch GitHub so yes there were so a few lines have been added to the config and this is about the update and how to switch from the ASCII look to the picture looks like the actual logo that we used to have and it will go on an article on articlinux.com so um, basically there's an update going on so if you update your system there are a few commands you need to know on articlinux update is one of them and articlinux new fetch kit has just been created and we say yes install it if then they say, hey, look, but we installed it in etc scale, it means it's not applied. So if you don't apply um, this code, it will never be used. But let's first, before I apply it, take a look at what we have already. So in your config, in your new fetch, there are lots of logos, all kinds of colors, depending on the wallpaper you have. And there are three files. So these, th these three uh, should go, basically, but um, let's do a scale first to see what happens. So if you type scale, it's an alias, uh, everything is an alias, <laughs> efficiency, you know. So update is actually uh, pseudo pacman minus syyu. So that's the command if you're on phase five, Arch Linux, we just call it update. And then there's another command, which is scale, which is going to copy paste everything in the etc scale to your own home directory. So if we do a scale, a scale, something is going to change. Check out the left side. And there is a one file more. And so let's now clean it up. So this one we don't need anymore. That one we don't need anymore. We just keep these two guys. This is the config if we do control T. This is still ASCII, nothing changed, right? But if you want to have a logo instead of a config.conf, so an ASCII look, then we need to do something very simple. Rename it, that's it. This is the configuration file that's used. This is for NeoFetch rubbish, right? It's not used. It has the, the wrong name, so it will never be used. But config.conf, that's the name he's going to look into. So I'm going to rename this guy to ASCII. Don't put it at the end because of the code that NeoFetch contains. You need to put it in the front. So ASCII and then dash config or your name, that config, anything else, but not starting with config. So if I start it again, sorry, now I was doing that as well. So NeoFetch then um, he's going to keep using oh yeah okay got it what happens if he doesn't find the config.conf he's going to create a new one as you can see this just came out of the blue that's because he says hey there is no config.conf right so he's creating its own and this logo is coming from from the neofetch file user bin neofetch right so i need to change this logo to config like this and if I do it like that then we get the logo back so the only thing I maybe want to do is instead of having something white you can go and have control find image you can have a uh, different kind of color which is this one is the white one the last one here so hashtag in hashtag out uh, pop, 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 pop. I think this was the original one. Let's see. Original color, I think so. So here you have a, uh, well, the previous uh, look of the logo and, and, and afterwards we developed the ASCII code, right? So if you wanna have this one, it's as simple as just changing names. Let's do that one time, one more time. So if you say, okay, this is, this is the look I wanna have, but I rather have it back. So ASCII needs to go, but we can't do that right now because first we need to move, uh, change this one, logo.config, 
because this needs to be named config.conf. You can't have uh, two files with the same name. So first logo.config uh, dash config and then config conf. Right. Whew. A lot of names. There you go. So we're back to square one. I mean, nothing changed now as still the ASCII code. It's just an easy switch for me if I want to change. I rename this one, I rename this one, done. And I have a logo again. All right, enjoy NeoFetch, enjoy Arch Linux.